All right, you guys, Papa John's is in the building. We all have our opinions about Papa John's, but this new crispy parm pizza, check it out. Is this about to be the best new fast food pizza in the game? Let's get into the review. What's going on? It's your boy, Big Ben. We back again with something new. You already know if something new just came out, it's something new. We got to talk about, yeah, people. I know I look different than the intro. Let me get right to the point. It's dark out here in Michigan. It gets dark early. Boom. Your boy, Big Ben, got a little nightlight, little flashlight. We out here creeping on a fast food game, baby. Looking good on this light. Shoo. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, y'all. Anyways, I digress here. I'm loving this light, y'all. I can do reviews at nighttime. It's only 618 in Michigan, but that's like 10 p.m. If you West Coast, you know. Um gets dark out here crazy it's a little depressing anyways okay all right all right papa john's y'all saw the intro some of y'all love them some of y'all hate them some of y'all think it's the best pizza i like papa john's i like they dough i like they crust I like they cheese I like they flavor some of y'all hate papa john's y'all saying it ain't getting down with diamond no forget that it ain't getting down with pizza hut then it ain't getting down, down with Domino's. Can't talk. Then it's not getting down with Little Caesars. They got a new pizza, y'all. Crispy Parm Pizza. Check it out. Check it out. Let the, let the little night light shine off of that thing. Look at that. Look at that. That thing is looking good. So what they talking about on here? So what they talking about on here? So this comes out February 2nd. Um, early access now with the app, right? Price is $12.99, not too bad of a price, but it's thin, it's crispy. Um, they say it, uh, it's, a, it's a signature thin crust, seasoned with a blend of shredded Parmesan Romano cheeses, baked right onto the bottom of the crust. It can be ordered with the choice of toppings. Now, I went with the OG cheese. I'm gonna tell you guys why, a little bit of story. Uh, I've been converted to just a cheese only pizza fan now. I'm gonna tell you guys why after I actually get into the review here, just in case you know you, you wanna know if you should get this or not. Uh, I wanna get that out the way and I'm gonna tell you a little story, okay? So stick around, stick around. But uh, we take the slice out. They go to the top right there, right? Nice little cheesy slice of pizza, but let's flip that bad boy over real quick. And that's that crust, y'all. That's that nice Parmesan crust really hard really crispy reminds me of the papadilla side note i reviewed the papadillas check out them reviews but nice little crunchy crust i already think i'm gonna be a fan because i like this thinness crispiness by the way a lot of syllables up in here <laughs> um but uh let's get into it papa john's crispy parm pizza here we go make sure to like subscribe y'all take the first bite that thing's looking good that thing's looking real good real Real interesting, like, here we go, y'all. A little nighttime review. First ever nighttime review, I think. Here we go. I don't know, man. Me and my house, Papa John's be hitting. That, that whole cheese, sauce, crust combo. Ooh, excuse me salivating reminds me of growing up with my boys and we used to debate this my boy zuby convinced me that papa john's is doing it well he ain't convinced me really the 90s pizza hut couldn't be beaten then after they fell off it convinced me that papa john's is really really good really really good y'all mm. mm. hit it from the bottom and the top you know what i'm saying <laughs> um, let me go back in right now the ratio I'm loving it loving the thin crust aspect the ratio the toppings the cheese the sauce 
nice crispiness. A little extra crispiness. Here's a little look at that Romano cheese right there on the bottom that's baked into the crust. Because I'm glad I showed that. I want that bite right here. Because although it's amazing, although I'm digging Papa John's, like an old boo thing, I kind of want it a little bit more crispier of a Parmesan pizza crust. I kind of want their regular crust as a Parmesan pizza crust. That might be doing too much. Big Ben, you're doing way too much out here asking for all that. This is the way to go. Hold on. I like this, y'all. I really like this. I gotta get a new slice. Because I'm gonna give this a, a really critical review. And right now, this thing is selling me. So I'm trying to do another bite. I don't even want to open this up. I'm not trying to go lethal with it and really send my whole taste buds to another universe because y'all know you dip that pizza in this. Mm hmm. We talking about 600 pound fatties. I'm all about that bite. Gotta respect the calories, but I, I can do one slice and dip in that thing. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna let y'all know right now. Um, sound like someone with a little stand off with the SWAT team. I'll do it. I'll dip that thing. Okay, I'm losing it. Um, anyways, let me talk about this real quick while I get my second slice and then I'm gonna dip it. But uh, I, it's gonna be pizza week, so I'm gonna drop this review. I might drop this review tonight, a little late night joint since I'm recording late night. Get the review out since it's a new item as soon as I can. But then second of all, I got um, the Big New Yorker Pizza Hut coming. So make sure to like and subscribe. I got a little Caesars joint coming with the collab. So make sure to like and subscribe. It's Pizza Hut. It's not Pizza Hut. It's Pizza Week, y'all. It's Pizza Week. All right, let me get to the second bite. Look at that crust on that one. That look pretty good. That look pretty good. Um, again, man. I don't know if the cheese is collecting at the end. This one hit me. Score wise, look. As I like to look at this from all different angles, if you love thin crust, this is a 10. If you don't normally do thin crust, this might come out and pop, pop out and just smack you. It really might, in a good way. Because right now I'm very surprised. I usually don't, I rarely get thin crust. So it kind of has me where I'm like, man, I want this on a normal crust, but at the same time. Ain't no point in breaking this. So I'm, a, I'm a just going to settle on a nine, but an asterisk of a nine that if you love thin crust, this is a 10. This this is me personally, like I'm at a 9.5 or a 10. So take one of those three scores. Okay. Maybe we'll meet in the middle 9.5. I'm digging this, guys. Absolutely digging this. This is a banging pizza. By the way. Like I said, I became a cheese only pizza fam. A little story time, Big Ben story time at nighttime. Get your pillow, get your blankie, your favorite blankie, maybe your favorite teddy bear. Cuddle up real quick. All right? I don't sing lullabies, I'll tell you a story. My go to pizza toppings is cheese, green pepper, pepperoni, Italian sausage. That's my go to pizza toppings. Perfect pizza in the world. I like Barstool Sports, David Portnoy. Port, Portnoy, I'm probably, I'm chopped his name though, wow. I like him, okay? He does a one bite, everybody knows the rules. Biggest content. Um, I went to, when I was in New York recently, I went to the top rated pizza place, or one of the top rated pizza places that he's given. It was He gave it a 9.3. It was like Angelo's Cold Pizza, I think was the name of it. Went there, dined in, got my usual go-to pizza, he gave it a 9.3. Pizza came out, looked great, looked amazing. I tried it and I was like, this ain't banging. How did he give this a 9.3? Everyone's taste is subjective, right? I, I really can't stand when people talk about it. Oh, I, da, da, da. I mean, it's not like I can't stand it, but at the end of the day, we all got our own taste buds, right? Point being long story short, short story long, I didn't 
I thought this did deserve a 9.3. So me trying to be critical, reverse engineer this process, I'm like, how did he give it a 9.3? The only difference is I noticed it was cheese only. It wasn't my go-to toppings. Next day, I go to some random pizza place, New York style pizza again, and I get just cheese. And I also get a slice of just pepperoni and cheese. Side by side, I was like, ain't nobody messing with the cheese sliced pizza. I felt like I was a kid all over again, Benjamin Button style, and I fell in love with cheese pizza. I was doing a bite of the cheese, a bite of the pepperoni, and I was like, the, pe the, the meat, although it's good, the meat, the grease and everything, it, it changes the whole dynamic of the pizza, even this right here. I feel like if I had one of these slices, looks fantastic. I feel like if I had all the meat toppings, that was the thing too, the meat toppings, like the grease collected at the end and everything like that, it's, the cheese is just like, it's just like, a, it's a nice balance, a nice, you know, exclamation point at the end of the sentence. It's a nice, punctual, pointed sentence. I'm a cheese pizza fan, guys. I challenge you. Get two pizzas, do a test like I did. Get two slices of pizza, one cheese only, one with your favorite toppings. There's something about the classic, no thrills, cheese pizza. Right now, oh, I forgot, hold on, hold on, let's get a little, let's get a little bit of that food porn. I was about to close down the shop, y'all. Let's get a little bit of that food porn real quick. Totally not respecting the calories, eating more pizza than I should, but it is what it is right now, y'all. It is what it is in this review. Get a little of that sauce, a little Dunkaroo. This right here, this right here will make you hurt somebody. Yeah, this right here will make you run across multiple states. Don't know what that means, but here we go. The garlic sauce. Mm hmm. <laughs> That'll make a grown man cry. Let out a little whimper. That's good, y'all. Totally unhealthy, not respecting calories. One more bite. Oh, a little grease drop. I ain't wanted to do that, but it is what it is. A little grease drop. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That bite. That bite. Might be a little too much. A little overkill. <laughs> Gotta enjoy moderation. That pizza's good, man. Really happy with Papa John's, what they're doing. Mm. Guys, let me know what you think about this Papa John's pizza. Papa John's crispy parm pizza. A lot of peas in there. A lot of syllables in there. A lot of pronunciations in there. Let me know what you think about this. Rolling out now. Nationwide, I believe. So, on that note, guys, make sure to like, subscribe. A lot more reviews coming this week. Officially, that's the review. As always, if you like the video, if you rock with me the whole time, please leave a like. Don't share one, share it twice, and drop a comment. Let me know what you guys want to see on the channel next. Whether you're a regular or first timer, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell reminder. Catch you guys next time eating something else. Peace.